Hey, buddy. Where's your buddy? So for the first super set, we did 15 bicep curls, 15 lateral raises, and 15 bend over rows. Three rounds of that. So for the second superset of exercises, we have hammer curl with a front raise and then also bend over fly. So you'll see we try and hit all the muscle groups with each superset. So we have a bicep, a bit of a shoulder or a front delt, and then also activating the back as well. And you'll see that I'm training in like chinos. That's just because I didn't bring exercise clothes but just eager to get an exercise in as well. So yeah, you have to improvise sometimes. Okay, last one, let's go. So that was a quick 20 minute workout upper body and I will post everything on the screen so you can just go have a look and basically what it is everything was done with dumbbells and because I didn't want to get out of my chair it's all free weight exercises it's an easy workout that you can just do at home so I just finished that training session and the point of this video is actually to show you how do you manage in a bathroom that isn't wheelchair accessible? So I'm staying at friends for the weekend and I have to use a bathroom that isn't completely wheelchair accessible. Well, I can't even actually get into the bathroom. So let me show you what I mean is I'm all the way pressed up against the shower and on the other side there is a, a little cupboard and I have to get into that bath over there. So I'm gonna show you what I do in an instance like this. So if you are able to maneuver yourself and get into that bath or to that toilet, then you can basically stay in any room. It doesn't have to be wheelchair accessible. Um, obviously it's not ideal, but you can always find a way to work around these things. So this is about as far as I can get into this bathroom. And I'm going to show you how I get onto this, this bath. I move myself forward in my seat. I take off my legs. And then it's important to, to get your weight forward where you want to go. And I just get a good hold on the bath and the basin. And I just make sure that it's not wet and I can actually slip um, and fall on the ground. So when I'm in this position, I lean forward to get my weight all the way over my legs 
So I lean forward and I just slide off my chair. So I can actually hold myself in this position and then just guide myself onto the side of the bar. And then getting into the bath, that is actually the easy part. Um, I would recommend putting towels on the side of a bath because it is very hard and you can actually hurt yourself and also take your clothes off inside the bath because doing this with our clothes is um, yeah it's, it's not ideal so I, I would not recommend that get your clothes off in the bath and um, then you can just basically shuffle if you need to get to the toilet you can shuffle on the side of the bath all the way to the toilet like this so that is basically what I would do in an instance where I can't even get into the bathroom because there are going to be times where you want to travel somewhere or you want to go visit friends or family and you're not, you're not always going to have a perfectly accessible bathroom or facilities and you must be able to adapt to that situation. So it took me some time to learn these things but it's, it's a pleasure to share that with you and enabling you to be, be, to be more independent and be able to, to travel more on your own and do these things and not be confined to, to life in a wheelchair. Okay, so there were obviously a few failed attempts and then you end up on the ground, um, which is actually not the end of the world. You can just lift yourself up with some, <laughs> with some effort.